when you try to understand something by casting one side is good and one side is evil, you're going to leave, you can understand some things that way, but you're going to leave a lot out. Mm -hmm. And I'm not holding both sides equal. I mean, there is definitely an oppressor and an oppressed here. Um, and there's like some level of a, in a way like, uh, gentler um, reenactment of the historical trauma. You know, the Palestinians are essentially confined to a ghetto right now. Right. Um, and they're not being exterminated en masse, but, you know, from time to time, the Israeli army, you know, bombs and, and you know, wreaks some destruction, you know, and kills a few hundred or a few thousand people. Like, it's kind of like this, this like attenuated reenactment of the Holocaust. Right. Um, and, you know, and you see like a lot of the same kinds of dehumanization, you know, especially among Israeli right-wing media. Right. Um, of, you know, dirty Arabs and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, there's something to look at there. Um, but just because you criticize something that Jewish people or a Jewish government is doing doesn't mean that you hate Jews as a as a category. And to me, like that's what anti-Semitism is. It's it's you know hating Jews or stereotyping Jews as a category. Mm -hmm. uh, but it doesn't mean that you can't criticize anything a Jewish person does or a Jewish government government does. Yeah, I mean, I don't think Israel's the worst regime on earth by any means. You know, and there is like a certain amount of like there is this question of okay, you're criticizing Israel, but why don't you criticize Saudi Arabia? Why don't you criticize Iran? They're you know doing. I mean, Saudi Arabia is way worse than Israel in terms of like what it did in Yemen, for example, uh, and what it does in its own country, the beheadings, you know, and all that kind of stuff, the the stoning of women for adultery. I mean, so there is this question. Okay, like why are you, you know, spending ninety percent of your energy criticizing Israel? Like what is governing that decision? Mm -hmm. um, so I think that that there is some some validity to that critique, but that doesn't excuse, especially people in Israel and Jews in general. If this is if we have a connection to this land, like this is our own home, you know, we and this is where we should um, focus our our scrutiny, um, and not say, well, somebody else is worse. <laughs> 